Recognizing that aviation is a catalyst for economic growth, President Mamadou Buhari says his administration will continue to encourage and support the actualization of projects that will place Nigeria's airports amongst the best in the world. The president spoke on Thursday at the commissioning of the new international terminal building of the Unamdi Azikiwe International Airport, Abuja. As it has correspondent, Kenya Modu reports. This is the second in the series of airport terminals to be commissioned from projects funded by the China Exim Bank loan of $500 million, with a counterpart funding of $100 million from the Debt Management Office. President Buhari had on the 25th of October commissioned the Port Harcourt International Airport Terminal. However, for political and economic reasons, the Inam de Azikwe International Airport is more strategic to Nigeria. This is because it is the gateway to the nation's capital and the second busiest airport in the country. Besides, it has the fastest growing passenger traffic in West and Central Africa, with an average growth rate of 8%, where the world average growth is 5.8%. The airport processed over 5 million passengers in 2017, a number that was about 13 times the total number of passengers recorded by Ghana. With a new terminal building, the numbers are bound to increase. The terminal building you are about to commission, Mr. President, has annual passenger capacity of 15 million, 15 million, covering a space of 56,000 square meters, and many other facilities that are properly designed and laid out in accordance with modern requirements for airport operations. With the airport in the bag, President Buhari says his administration is committed to developing Nigeria into a regional air transportation hub which will ensure that the country assumes leadership in the aviation subsector in Africa. Nam Azikwe International Airport Terminal is the first airport terminal in the country, and indeed West Africa, to be connected to rail transport system. This will provide passengers and other airport users with a choice in the mode of transport to and fro the city center from the federal capital. Kain Amodu, STV News.